Hello, 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 dreamers, and welcome back to Dream Queen by Perla. So, Cancer, this is your monthly reading for the month of July. We have bossing it up and no second guessing. Um, you guys are definitely taking the lead on something. There's something that you guys want to pursue. There's something that you guys have been thinking about. There's something that you guys have been contemplating, and it's like it's the time is now. There is no more waiting. There is um, just taking the risk and taking the chance. It's almost like you guys are either having dreams or having visions or having a lot of daydreaming of what it is that your life is meant to be like. And you guys are just going for it. You guys are definitely in this energy of, it's almost like a lot of people are looking at you cancer and are thinking like you're working too much, you're spending too much on something, but they... They lack the vision, is what I'm saying. They lack the vision of what has been shown to you, of where it is that you are headed. So you cannot allow those people to kind of stop you, right? Um, not allowing people without dreams to stop you from reaching yours. There is definitely a lot of uh, a lot of time spent on um, by yourself, a lot of solitude. But the solitude is not. It's not something bad. It's something that you're doing by choice, again, because you're working so hard on on something. You're working very hard on building something or creating something. It's like you have a lot of creative energy during this time, Cancer, and it's like you're putting it to use. You're you're putting it to a good, to good work, let's put it that way, which in terms, unfortunately, does require you to spend a lot of time by yourself. But it's like, it's almost like you don't even mind it. You really don't. You are just focused. There is, there are no obstacles. There are no blockages for you at the moment. I do feel that there are people that are going to, you know, reach out and just be like, hey, you need a break. Hey, let, let's do this. Let's do that. There's definitely invites and things like that coming through of people wanting you to just kind of like chill for like a second. And not for nothing, Cancer, there are going to be times where you are, you know, going to have to just like for a couple of hours, just allow yourself to kind of breathe and enjoy like everything should not be just work, 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 even though for this month, there's definitely a lot of work. This is definitely going to be opening up a lot of opportunities when it comes to collaborating with other people, when it comes to traveling to different places. Whatever it is that you're creating is opening up those opportunities, those doors for you, Cancer. Um, there's definitely somebody from your past. Um, this is definitely an excess energy that is constantly thinking of you, is constantly wanting to reach out, but I don't see them reaching out. The, the reason for that, I don't know why they're showing me... Uh, like an open mouth with like the tongue sticking out and what is coming out with that is this energy of somebody that said either very harsh things to you and now they want to take it back and they don't know how to um just be careful because there's there's still some deceiving energy when it comes to this person unfortunately um i feel that the the bossing up that energy of you moving forward this energy of you uh, taking control of your life um, has them a little jealous, um, believe it or not, which is, is kind of odd because if it's somebody that wants to be in a connection with you romantically, then they shouldn't be jealous of your success. So again, just be very careful with this person coming back. Be very careful with this person um, trying to come back as, as things start to go well for you. Because there's definitely an energy here of cancer of this person wanting to tell you how to do things, wanting to tell, like, it's almost like they want to come and take control of what you have built and you're not having that. So again, just be very careful. There's certain things about this person, either things that they, especially things that they say that trigger you. Um, but again, just. I feel that for the most part, Cancer, a lot of you are keeping your distance when it comes to this person because this is almost like a repetitive um, energy for them. This is somebody that is always in and out. And it's like whenever it seems that you're getting your, your life together, they want to come on in. So let's go ahead and see what is um, this business, this creative energy. What is going on with that when it comes to Cancer? The star, the king of cups, 
and then the eight of swords so again when it comes and, and i feel that this goes back i was trying not to pull cards on this person but it's, it's almost like <clears throat> excuse me guys this person definitely comes in to to kind of interfere in one way or another um when things are going good for you um cancer I really don't like this person's energy. If this is not an ex, it can definitely be anybody from your past. Maybe a friend that um, you haven't talked to in a very long time. Maybe somebody that you had a falling out with. But whatever the case may be, whoever's energy this is, it's almost like when, when things are going good for you, right? When you're moving in the direction that feels right, it's like they come in and try to mess with that now the word gaslighting is coming through maybe um this is more than one person or something like that it's almost like somebody's trying to confuse you when it comes to to what it is that you're doing so just keep an eye on that um whoever that person is the king of cups energy keeps on flipping out the king of wands and then justice so again it, Hmm. This is definitely coming to an end is the way that I'm picking it up. Some of you are going to have to stand up for yourself. Some of you are going to have to call this person out in order to get justice. Um, some of you are going to have to um, cut some cords and really set very strict boundaries with this person. Because again, this King of Cups energy, for some reason, I'm just getting this energy of... Somebody that comes in very caring and very loving or very understanding or etc. But behind that, the intention behind that is not the same. So here we have the Prince of Swords with the Hierophant and then the Four of Swords in the reverse. So again, there, there are things, there are going to be areas in your life where you're going to have to stand your ground. There are going to be areas in your life where you're going to have to just tell people like, no, whether it is just that one person or multiple people, it's like needing to stand for what you believe, needing to stand up for your dreams, for what it is that you're pursuing without, without feeling like you have to sacrifice anything, right? It's almost like you're getting to that point where those that are meant to be in your life are going to be in your life and those that aren't are not and it's almost like you were bending over backwards to keep certain people right happy and in the midst of it you yourself weren't happy so it's almost like now you're putting yourself and your happiness first which is exactly what you should be doing cancer well cancer let's go ahead and i would like you to go ahead and ask a question Let's go ahead and set this down so that you guys can see you. So ask your question, set your intention, ask a specific question, and let's see if we can get an answer um, for you guys. So it's giving me the answer no. So whatever you're asking about at the moment, um, right now is not the right time. Or it's it's almost like you have to wait a little longer. Um, I'm almost picking up this energy of like something better coming along. So whatever it is that you ask, the answer is no for the moment. Well, Cancer, that is all that I have for you for this month. As always, guys, thank you for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel as well as donating. If you would like a private reading, the link to my website is down below in the description, along with the links to Facebook, Instagram, and Patreon, if you would like to follow me on those platforms. Sending every single one of you love, strength, and blessing, guys. Take care. Love you all. Bye-bye.